Hey guys, how's it going? Zombie back with another customization video for you guys today. This one is on the Hijack Chameleon, or yeah, Chameleon. That, that's what it looks. That's what it looks like. It read as. Um, anyways, this is another electric vehicle. I know some people are not going to be really into it, but anyways i'm gonna i'm gonna go ahead and show where you can buy this thing it is not super crazy not overly exciting but you can get it in legendary motorsport it's literally right here i got it for free i don't know if it's free for everyone but i wanted to get this one done because i have an electric car garage tour that i'm going to be doing sometime soon and this was a pretty good addition to it and i really love maserati and aston martin stuff but that's going to lead me into the next topic here. Um, this thing is based off of a Fisker Karma Sunset, an Aston Martin Vanquish, or a Maserati Gran Turismo. Um, some people are going to be like, oh, it's, it looks more Aston Martin-like. But it is an electric car, as you guys can hear. It is pretty damn quick for being free, guys. I, I don't know why they gave a they're giving me an electric car for free, but... It, it's pretty nice looking it's a very big luxurious sports car and i'm loving this one um i bought this thing a couple weeks ago and i really did not expect to like this thing um this is my first time driving it and it's already given me good feelings out of it, it like this is one of my favorite electric cars so far just went over the freaking median very nicely there and it didn't sound like it was just completely being tore up about it being a little bitch about it you know <laughs> but we're gonna get right into the customization this one's gonna be a pretty quick one I, I could probably guess but i don't honestly know it has 18 customizations that's pretty good but here's a nice good look at it i kind of it, it's not a bad looking sports car you can see the little solar panels on the top there this i think this is gonna be the first one that i've ever seen with solar panels like this but we're obviously going to go ahead and just start the customization. Pretty easy stuff on the brakes and armor. Obviously, same old... Oh, whoops. Didn't mean to buy that. Um, you got two exhausts? What? This thing is an electric car. What the... F oh, it's probably a dual. Like, it's probably electric and gas powered. So, we're going to go ahead and just throw on dual exhausts. Um, obviously, you have the explosives. You got the you got the hood options very easy you got the carbon hood and then you got the double vented i'm gonna put on the double vented there man um for headlights we're gonna throw xenon on and plate wise yellow on black as always we got the respray um for the roof you can make it to where it's not so uh electric car like um I'm sure there's still the electric car look on there, but you got the painted and then you got the carbon. I, I'm, I'm kind of digging the carbon, though. That's pretty clean. Um, but I'm going to go with the painted roof because I, I don't like the look of those solar panels, and they're kind of ugly looking, you know. Um, you got three options for the spoiler. You got none. You have the low-level spoiler, and then you have the high-level spoiler. I'm going to go with a pretty simple low-level spoiler there. Um, obviously lower this thing, uh, turbo on it, wheels, um, get rid of this freaking wheel smoke, smoke shit, I don't ever put those on, um, whoops, uh, wheel type, um, I'm gonna throw on sports rims on this thing, because it's definitely a sports car, you guys can obviously see it's a sports car, don't, don't get, don't bash me, it's a sports car, <laughs> at least in this game, um, I'm kind of just digging the stock wheels, man. I'm going to keep the stock wheels because I'm not a big fan of the uh, other things. I'm not going to throw on color because it's, uh, it's a Maserati, Aston Martin stuff, you know. I don't think it's necessary. You limo this shit out, obviously. I didn't really say much about that. Um, for respray, you got a basic respray on this thing. Um, let me get rid of this crew emblem. Uh, whoops, didn't mean to do that. Primary color. I'm going to show you guys the chameleon, obviously. I know I haven't been doing that lately. Pretty simple stuff. Not too crazy. I kind of like the black prismatic, but I'm going to go with the metallic stuff as I usually do. I might just do a graphite because that looks pretty clean. Um, we're going to check out the other colors, though. I know some people are into the huge colors and making this thing their own, and this is just a whole other thing for me. Um, I'm not digging anything other than the silver, really, to be honest with you guys. There's a nice white on it. That's not too bad. Um, 
I'm definitely gonna go with the graphite. I love how the graphite looks. Um, there's not really much to do to this car, guys, to be honest with you. Um, uh, yeah, it's just kind of basic. So, we're gonna go ahead and drive this sucker out. I wonder if it stays electric if you uh, remove the solar panels. Yeah, it stays electric. That's pretty cool. All you can really hear is the tires screeching, but yep. That's how it is, guys. Um, let's see how this thing performs afterwards, and we'll kind of give it a rating. Whoa. Is this going to be the next sleeper car, bro? Holy shit. This thing actually... Like, I did not expect a lot from this thing. This is actually pretty damn good, man. Holy shit. This thing has some pretty decent takeoff speed, too, it being electric and everything. But god damn is this thing good. I actually really like this thing. It, it, I did not expect to like it, it being free and all. But we're gonna go ahead and park it right here in front of my ar- or in the back of my arcade. That doesn't sound right, but either way. Um, so I showed you everything, how to get it, what it's called, uh, to just ignore the hood just bulging a little bit there. Uh, Ooh, personal rating. I don't think I'm going to be putting a personal rating on this thing. I just don't see a reason why. Um, for a little bit more of a regular rating, it is free, so it's a relatively good free electric car. And I know some people are going to be all, oh, it's electric, it's trash. Um, it's really your opinion on electric cars. Um, this one is, this one I can't give a personal rating because I'm not a big fan of electric cars personally, but. It has a wide-ish body, and I love how that looks. It reminds me of the Bravado Banshee a little bit, but eh, I don't know. This thing's kind of pretty. I like how this thing looks, apart from the hood being bulging right now, but it's relatively small. It's a really nice sports car that I'm getting for free. I don't know if it's free for everybody, but I'm going to assume it is. Um, Customization-wise, it's pretty piss poor to be honest um do i like this vehicle yes and no um I, there's so many other electric vehicles in my electric vehicle garage already that i like more than this thing and this thing is pretty nice it's a nice sports car that you get for free um but is that gonna save its rating probably not the rating i'm gonna have to give is probably a 6.2 um, there's so much better customization that they could have thrown on this thing. It's kind of piss poor on, on handling. It's just, it, it's fast and all, but it's not the greatest thing in the world. Um, would I recommend you buy it? Probably. If it's, it's free, what, what, can, what, what is there to lose? It's free. Unless you customize it, you, you'll, you won't lose very much money. So I mean, I started off with almost 700k, and it's just 200k to customize this thing, pretty much. It's not really that bad on customization, but it's still very piss poor. Um, am I going to keep this thing? Absolutely, because it is free, and it's one of those ones that people are going to be like, oh, why didn't you have this in your electric car garage? But I'm going to go ahead and throw it in my electric car garage and kind of give y'all a little look at it so far. So, we got quite a few electric cars in here already, apart from uh, the Brioso and uh, the Skyline and the Carbon is there. The rest of these are electric, so I, I do plan on doing an electric car garage. I'm already up to one, two, three, one, two, three, four... Yeah, I only have four electric cars so far. Um, I might skip a couple of them just for, like, customization videos, but look at how those two cars, the very the very nice Tesseract, the Raiden looks super dope. I love the Raiden a lot. Um, you got the Coil Voltic, and then you have this free car that's not too bad looking. It, it kind of fits in there. Um I didn't like, I didn't like, I, I kind of like the regular rims on this thing, so I kind of just kept it like that, and Aston Martin and Maserati, they're, they're, you shouldn't really put custom rims on those, this is a sports car that you could, you should be driving in general, just 
without that kind of stuff. It's not necessary. Um, so like I said, um, pretty good rating on it. Um, but I think that's it for this video. Leave a like if you guys like these customizations. I know this was a very simple one, and I don't think it's going to be a crazy car or anything that I keep for long term. Um, while you're down there, comment if you guys want me to do any other customizations. Anyone that you guys recommend, I will say your name in the next video. Kind of giving a shout out like, hey, go check this guy out or something like that. I know some people are into that and I'm, I don't really care about shout outs. I've never really been one for shouting out people. And I know that would probably help me out, but I don't, I just don't see myself doing it, man. Plus I don't think I earn shout outs that way. I just, I don't want to go into somebody's channel and intrude on their shit unless they're doing it wholeheartedly. I think it's bullshit to do that. Um, but subscribe if you guys haven't yet. I know most of y'all aren't subscribed, and I'd really appreciate a follow, subscription, whatever you guys want to call it. It's It would help me tremendously, and it would encourage me to do more videos like this. Um, I've been saying in the last couple videos that I have Dead Space and High on Life play it through going, and I can't wait to upload those. I do want to upload all of them at the same time and kind of get them out pretty quickly, but I want to get some customizations going on GTA as well, so... I don't know. I might I might uh, throw up these customizations and then start uploading the High on Life and uh, Dead Space stuff. I know y'all. Some people are gonna be looking forward to that. Others aren't. Um, but anyways, I hope you guys like the video. Um, I will see you guys in the next video or live stream. Peace out, you guys.